then obviously they're unaware that there's a problem. Um, but obviously, it's a, the, the curvature becomes apparent uh, when it's erect. The partner, when they become sexually aware, points it out to them. You've got a pro, you know, you've got a bent penis, which can be quite painful for them. I mean, if you've got a 90 degree curvature, well, the young guys they have extra length, which makes the treatment a bit easier because the simple treatments are a bit easier. But so they have long penises, but normal erections and normal ejaculation. I mean, we're talking about congenital curvature, which is a normal penis, but there are other curvatures so that they're born with. So conditions such as um, hypospadias, and as we, I think as urologists are guilty of that, you know, good job done, everything's nice and, you know, there's no surgical problem anymore. Um, we know their erections are absolutely normal, whereas the Peyronie's disease, of course, we don't know that, and that's why we keep following them up. And yeah, what happens to these patients? We don't know what these ha what happens. I don't know, but I don't actually know what happens to him from a sexuality point of view after that.